before I start the volume, I'm gonna go into the game because otherwise you guys will be deafened by it. We are chapter two, day twenty-five, difficulty normal still. Now you guys can have that was a chasing around. They're currently way too busy. Also, hello Asuka. Hello, I'm Melman. Always great to have you guys here. So, yesterday I said when I quit that I may shuffle around some of my furnishings, and I did. I feel like I created something of a safe situation, but we will see how it really goes. The only thing I'm not 100% of is the window. Because you can't really block it that well. But we will see when we get there. Because... He's blocked it quite well. I just have to place something here or a stand here and then I block the two doors without even barricading them. But that would mean that I stand at the window or put something there. Which I'm not I also put some of the things that I probably need in here because we don't have the luxury of having the workbench in our room. And yes, we are at the... We are at the swamp. We haven't really seen much. And that's where we are right now. Oh. So. Hmm. Good. Good is always good. Oh. Oh, okay, this is where we shot that dude. Hmm. If you hear bonks in the background, that is Luna because she has the zoomies. Don't wanna go into the village just yes. something there, I think. Ah, it's rotten. Luna! Very fast, but... I keep hearing noise, but I think it's just back. They just... Go, go. Go. What are you doing? Bugging out? <laughs> hmm. Yeah, this map is quite big. I already know. It. Gonna be a bit of a pain. I also suspect there to be at least one aquatic enemy. Nothing. Really? Really? Hmm. Oh, that's fair. <clears throat> this area is really large and really empty for now at least. Been here already? Yeah, shiny stone might be a trap. Ah. I wonder if this thing gets up. This is eggs.
and I want to arrest it, but I don't know. Oh, it's not. Okay. This one is works. Yeah, that one twitches. That one will. Must be the top then. Wall? Or not? Oh. Okay. Is that a trumpo? That's a trumpo. One more. Let's do the surround thing. Good. Oh, when I said at least one more, I'm already using a skill. God damn it. It didn't let me shout. Hi, Ellie. Okay, they pushed. I have an idea. Mm -hmm, 11 months. A long time. Okay. So. Also, at least now it works. Because apparently last time it didn't. Don't have any lockpicks, but I lost one. That is no problem because I have an idea. I'm not entirely sure how it's going to work. But we will see. Hope they're not outside. Okay, perfect. perfect. This is good. Wait, this is the ruin, right? I need to close this door real quick. Okay. That wouldn't of course. And it's a crap shot. Hear me. Really? Cool. Love it. Um, plan B, plan B. No, not that. That. Oh, it didn't affect you. Of course it didn't. I'm gonna die to poison. Wow, how many f freaking... Whoa! There's like six in that house. That 
Is that worth it? No more ammo. Of course not. Is that worth it? Oh, Man. Okay. Um, plan D. Uh, traps. 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 Uh uh, did she drink? Bad. Enough for a level up? It is. Once a day I will become invisible to hmm. More health, let's go. Less effect. Increase healing items, less effect. Cannot afford to miss. Oh, half a bar extra. Let's go. What a luxury. <laughs> Cats. Oh my god. You can see Bärchen on the thing. She's being bad. Okay, so the next plan is try to get them one by one and lure them into traps. Because apparently the game is being a pest. I wonder if those return. Or if there's still out oh, no. What do I hate this area? It's so many. It's so fucking many. It's pointless. Just try to do some damage. It is. Oh, I killed one, I think. Okay, we, we definitely. Okay, I'm dead. We definitely have to do this some other way. Stand. Maybe I got really unlucky missing that barrel. Maybe that was the real problem here. I'll have to think about how I do this other than just throwing myself at it. <clears throat> Maybe a Molotov cocktail seems suited for this. Maybe I have to think outside the box. Regardless, this is gonna be a real shitty night considering I have no ammo at all. <clears throat> <clears throat> you did... You were... What? You were up at 8 and did tidying? <laughs> yeah, no clips at all. Some other mammal, but nothing to load it into. I mean, technically, we have like three bullets, I think, in this. It's kind of accurate. But I can at least not look in. Hey, 
Yeah. Don't be like that game. We tested this. Yeah. Oh, this is. I, I don't want to be the middle bit. <laughs> I suppose I could be here. I'm not gonna go closer to the wall. That's gonna give me a fright if it attacks the window. I'm okay with that. Also, I'm just re-precautioning because I think if the thing comes through the middle, I can kite it reliably into this. Mm-hmm. Some poet? What the fuck then? Okay, yeah, let's hope for the best. We need this money from the night. We really need that. Dogs, maybe? This one? Oh. Really? Right away? No, shovel's enough then. Hmm? Wait, you can break that? I thought if it says it's too strong to remove, it's unbreakable. Ah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, all right, you can break that. Okay. Well. Dog. One, two, at least three? To. But wait, 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 wait. <sighs> okay. This is quite the step up here. Um, okay. I didn't think it would break. I saw it. <clears throat> okay. So these things can. Break. That's one port. It's quite a damper to my thing now. Okay. Okay. Um. <clears throat> we'll do a big thing. Find so many of these that I'm going to sell them for now. It's not great, but it's gonna give us some cash, which we desperately need for ammo. I don't know. It's not even that bad, actually. 350. I 
I know, Luna. Life is not fair. I'll take the EXP too, considering I have a little extra. We need to solve this. Okay, you're worthless now, sadly. You didn't even do much for us. Yeah, I need more ammo targets. And I need to be able to build a proper shotgun. Not a single unit. This would break. Open it said too strong to remove it would not be even a target. I think that was naive to assume. <coughs> How do we solve this? How do I solve Hmm. More trap. Eat a bean? We'll eat a bean. It'll cheer us up. <laughs> no, that wasn't a good spin. No! Good spin. What's wrong? That is juicy pear or burger. Ah, my favorite. There you go. It's a green one. I should bugger. Ah. I'm gonna try this again with the barrel. We need to find a way to solve these five, six. Chompers. Because now I really want what's inside there. Yeah. Now it's now it's just about principle. <clears throat> like my head tells me, explodey barrel, shoot explodey barrel, boof. Everyone happy. Hold on. I know I started the time now, but it's I wanna make a Molotov cocktail if I can make one. <clears throat> It's all or an empty pot. Which... Okay. But at least we now know what we're looking for. Like, what games are you into, Mel? I do have loads of suggestions, but it always depends on what the person wants to play. Oh, thank god I got him. He couldn't have stepped into <laughs> Okay, so apparently you can only use one skill at a time, which means we can't use our look. And there's also a fucking wolf here now. I feel like they attacked faster here. Yeah, we should have moved. Okay, at least I didn't die. I'll take that. Um, friends, can we, like, chill? Uh, 
old. Uh, that's why they're so weak. Yeah? Well, games that I, as a person, really like is. Uh, that's from the. What is it called? Is my barrel still there? It's not. Why the fuck? Like, one of my favorite games is Subnautica, because it's such an abstract horror. Never mind, we're gonna use it. What the fuck are there still so many? Jesus fucking Christ! Like every time I kill one of these guys, two more come by the looks. There's another two! What is in there? The Holy Grail? <laughs> now it becomes sunken cost, whatever the thing it's called. Now I put so much into it, now I have to finish it. Fucking. What, what could be in there? Nicholas Cage is in there? He better be for well, how much we're spending for this nonsense. The Declaration of Independence? Watch me go in there and it's like, here's your two clips. <laughs> Here, an empty bottle for the mullet. You can't make... No! <laughs> Everything's terrible. I don't even have a bullet anymore. <laughs> I'll take the meat. It's fine. Look at this fucking slaughter field. At least it's nice enough to continue going in there. Let me. Yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna combine it with the shout. I, I, I have to solve this. Okay, this was good. This was good. Um, please don't step into that trap. That's too expensive for you. Okay, realistically, I think... Oh, build. There's still at least one in here. Yeah, there is. Great. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah. And now stay the fuck down. And I swear, if there's anything in here, I'm gonna lose my mind now. I want at least... 5 million credits. What would you? Uh, do I still have lost inventory? I do. Um. Uh, we can. 
we can drop it. Oh, no, no matters. That's fine. Okay, I'm full, but this is a. It's fine that we're making this return. Okay, let's practice next. I, th I think I just have to assume that every poisonous um, mushroom can become one of these dudes now. But I think we managed. We're gonna take a light source as well. Uh, we also have to cook. Yeah. Fail. Do you see me doing this? Like, at least remotely? Hydrate? Well, hydrate. Cheers. <sighs> Yeah. Meat will sell tomorrow. That's a lot of EXP. And. Oh, kills. What? Oh, yeah, it wouldn't. Yeah, okay. Ah, hold on. What's that? Just cost us. <clears throat> That's good EXP though. Um, I also like Dragon's Dogma as a game. I think I like. Uh, but that's more of an action e game, class based. The story is, however, horrendous, but the gameplay is really nice. It's also really fun to see... Why is that... Bubbling? Oh, it's mushroom man. Um, something like scribble notes, I feel. Played scribble notes like at the very beginning, it was quite fun. I feel that's like ages ago. So are we ready for the big surprise of what we're going to find? Because so far it's not worth it. Seems to be blocked from the other side. How? There's no other way in. There's a window down there, but I'm quite sure it's going to be blocked. Actually, yeah, this was. Oh, thank God we didn't miss this. That would have been really expensive to miss. Hmm. Yeah, it's. It does take damage. One more will do. Okay, but how about you really get in? Go come on, Gabe, don't do this to me. What is your deal today? You can't just... Oh my god, Gabe. Uh, it's clearly not barricaded, as you can see. I can even put another one up. Oh. Oh, I can search the crate though. <laughs> oh, I think I just bugged out that entire room so hard. Ah. <laughs> 
Oh, I'm in so much pain. <laughs> We do have a clip so we can reload it. That's uh, that's turned out to face. You wanna wake up? I wanna shoot you, you. Can sit down. We go building. I think I have another. The hole's good. We can make a molo <clears throat> molotov cocktail with that. Stones will just drag. Layers we're gonna sell. Keep those we're gonna sell. And let's put now. Fabric, I think I'm gonna sell for now. I need it. The, the new slot, even if it gave me one, would not be worth it right now. Combine these. That. I need to repair my tool. <clears throat> Nails go up here. Um, I think we can add iron bolt battery into the other. Yeah, okay. Didn't give me. It gave me quite a bit of things, so I will not complain about it. Um, but it was still a very compressed thing of way too many enemies. So I really am not doing anything. Same with the rock. Uh, we can leave these with us and eat them. Okay. Managed to get up. Tomorrow we explore the village. I don't know if we can go fully in there, but we'll see how it goes. Got quite a bit to go Wood Valley. Um want a board. Nails for the night. Also traps. Do I have the luxury of building traps? I can make one. Fuck it, we make. Yeah. We can't put that here because the flashlight was there. <clears throat> okay. What a start. Let's put it there. That's cool. <clears throat> Oh yeah, you like that game. Oh 
not gonna hold. And this is not big enough to hold it. Because I need to stand here now. Ah, okay. <clears throat> need this win actually i do not need it at all because we have a lot to sell but i want the extra <clears throat> i'm gonna place one in the middle already no how it ends i have to scream that's really good already Here we go. The other lamps are too close to my windows right now. I noticed too late. I don't want them to shine outside. I don't know if it matters or not. But they're both in, in reach, so if I need them, I can swap them on right now. It's something barricaded, but not near us. Is that dust over there? Is that a sign that something borrows there? This here? Where am I getting paranoid now? Under me? Oh, calm the fuck down. Oh. Ha ha, funny. That's a spike in difficulty. Okay, okay. It spawned under me and pushed me into my trap. Like, what am I meant to say about this? <laughs> ah. Like, why did it spawn under me? I don't. I wonder if I have to keep moving. Or if that was just really, really bad luck. Yeah. Anyway, we got a lot to sell, actually, so I'm quite happy. It was a good haul. How much do we have? This is good. This... Okay. All ammo. All of that. You have bottles of any kind now. Take this, I'll take this, I'll take 
Entonces, But can I see it before it burrows out? That's the real feel for me. Like, did I do a mistake by standing still? Could I have seen it? That's what I want. Did we not have two shiny stones, or did I buy them? Like, I was certain that, if anything, <clears throat> the thing, many, the thing, the dust that I saw was going to be the thing that comes up. Yeah, that was both at the same time. It's okay, we made we made the money. We made the money that we need. So surviving the night was a bonus. And even right now, we're plus 500. Which in Asuka terms is not much, but for us it's a lot. Hmm. Yeah, I know us. For us, this is really good, but for Suka, this is nothing. But what do you buy with all that money? There's not that much you could buy. Yeah, never use it on anything. <clears throat> mm hmm. I would rather have a lantern with me, honestly. Uh, five lockpicks gotta be enough. This is enough. We don't take. We have two healing. We have one healing item. One in slot two. Yeah, okay. The healing item. Take the Molotov here. We have one extra clip. Not much. Professional help thing. Boarding, yeah. <clears throat> oh! Yeah, 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 okay, I, I remember what you guys are on about now. We need to turn off. Need to fill that. Might as well do it now. So the village is just right of us, which I don't know if is fortunate. Yeah, it was point to talk. What? I think I'm up off. Holy boys. What? 
I need to see them. Then again, I know. Oh, that's... Is that a modded Roman? I legit cannot see these here. What is going on? The figure of the shrine bears the signs of teeth. Partially eaten. No, I was hungry. These I can see, but I don't know the, the ones. Oh wow, are you kidding me, game? Right. Wait. No? I was certain these things would spawn. Holes. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. But yeah, I was certain they would jump up. Her turn. No, friend or foe. Part of me doesn't want to bang him over the head yet. Got another fabric. Wait, no, alcohol fa no, no, fabric. That's a lot of money. So even if we don't last the night, we got a good backup here. All about making back. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm looking at the chat room. As you can as you know. A little bit of Yeah, heavy foot. Something saw me. Okay. And if I could see it, yes, I see those. My point. It's a dog and then dies to him, right?
should go back. Okay. Good haul, good haul. Let's return the stuff. Still freaks me out that I thought these guys come to life. Like, is the game fucking with me or am I just overthinking it? He's a monster? No. Game has me paranoid? It probably has. Like, it looked like such an obvious RPG trap. Was it? Are you going for a swim, doggo? Sometimes you have them real easy and sometimes you don't have them. But your meat can stay. Right, I'm too low actually, I think. That was good, that was good. Um more stuff now. No. That fabric alone saves us the next day. Um uh, Oh, I can't even craft anymore. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Um, here, take the last block pick. Both go over. Nine volt, and the other goes over. Knife, we sell. Torch, we sell. Player, we sell. Could do with another one of those. Good enough for now. Um, more. This ammo in here. Two. Yeah, okay. Back into the village. the same way. It's not taking damage. What do you mean armored? Like, is this an option now that they have? Like, unkillable? He's less to shoot. as well, huh?
Can I melee it though, is the real question. Can you for like a s oh my god. Combat. It's coming all back. It's all repeating itself. But now it's foggy? Oh god. Get this vision. I'm bad. So what, now I have to watch out for undying enemies in here? Cool. Hold on there. I don't. Know. I don't know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, he left behind them. The light seems to hurt it. Uh, it also seems to push me into a corner. Point light on thing. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Whose fire is this? Bloody hell, you're alive! We found a dwarf. <clears throat> Might be Mur. Mur's always a dwarf. The old man extends his hands, blindly trying. You're not from around here. Cannot be. All them lads are dead. It's only me and me and. He finally finds my arm, and grabs it. For a moment, he clutches my hand in silence, and I hear him mumbling under his breath. I don't have anything, mate. Only this, this chair. Bloody. He gaze, his gaze stops somewhere under the leaky door and feeling. Huh? The old man suddenly jumps up. What are you saying? Feel his long thing and was digging into my hand. Ain't no fucking tree, that. It looks like a tree, but those faces. I know I'm buggers. Every single one of them. So close. And so fake. They're not real. They're not. From time to time, I thank God I went blind. I don't have to look. The old man lets go of my hand to lean against the broken back of the chair. He sighs with relief. It disgusts me. Fucking disgusts me. This buggery. This fucking scum. All the time I have to listen to its pathetic blabber. Complaining all the time. 
As if I were supposed to believe it's human. That it's me, Zorkar. Uh, yeah, right. He suddenly reaches toward me with both hands, almost falling from the chair. He grabs onto my sleeve. <clears throat> I feel all his weight on me. You lad, you've got your hands and legs. Strong arms, I beg you, get rid of that filth from my village. I can't bear here another day of that abomination veiling and sobbing. I want to die in peace. Fucking hell. Yeah? I want to die in peace. Listen to me. I thought about it for a long time. I've had a lot of time to think for fuck's sake. His eyes widen. He puts a milky light. I can feel him climbing my coat. <laughs> you need to find the basement. Jess seeks basement. I remember it. It's right next to the tree. The tree is too large, so if you can't reach it from the top, you've got to try from the bottom. Find the basement. And there surely you will find the tree roots. A bloody thing must have roots. That's where they are. Destroy them, pull them, drag them, twist the fuck out of them, you'll find a way, eh? I know you will. The old man sliding down my coat. St what the f- what is- <laughs> Straight into his destroyed wheelchair. For a moment he searches for a stone, which he uses to pop himself up against the money floor from- Thank you, thank you. What? What do you mean show item? He's blind! The old man grabs the photograph, feels it, and then takes out a small glass object from his pocket and puts it into his eye. The road, the road home. What a load of fog. Road of madness. What? What are you doing? The old man leans towards me. Here, war took my legs, and those wankers burned my house, and me picked. Um, but it was years after the war, they said. But these, so they said. And my Zok, the disease took her from me. Okay, so that's his wife. All I have is this wheelchair, this land. It used to be different here. First, the woods changed. The trees started sprouting up everywhere. We were cut off. Then the water flooded our fields. People went crazy out of hunger. They fought over food. Years ago, when me eyes were good, people used to pass through here. They would leave their huts and go. They were these damn trees go. They were often they would often leave at night so that no one can see them. They went into the deep dark woods. Came back. Some of them would say they were going home, but most of them were silent. I don't know. The land has changed. The trees have cut us off from the rest of the world. But home for me has always been here. Then the monstrous moaning and abomination grew out of the ground. It blocked the passage, that's that. No one has managed to pass through since then. Many people found some other place. Maybe they died. Like it. No one lives around here anymore. Everyone's dead. Only some of them. The men lower his voice. Sometimes I hear footsteps that wake me up at night. The sound of bare feet against the floor and bells, sort of. They come out of nowhere. They move towards the trees, then come back. They pass me and fall silent. They're like a nightmare, bloody night. If you come across some wheels, two little wheels, so that I could fix my chair, maybe you could benefit from it as well. Interesting. And game objective obtained. Thank you. Thank you for your fish. Before you leave, please see if you can do something for it. I mean, our inventory is not full yet. You can eat some. I'm just running out. Yeah, it's. We're not that far. You are probably right. 
Interesting, interesting, interesting. This is a this is similar. It's not like Fallout, but. Oh, shovel. Stamina. No, not stamina. Whatever you want. Durability, that's the word I'm thinking. Uh, we go back to the game. That's probably safe. But... Okay, so that probably wasn't a black chomper. It was a red chomper with dark armor. Huh. Okay. Just straight back. Oh, so that is what's a black jumper. Okay. So basically, I have to kite them with a lantern before I can fight them. Oh, yeah. That means I have to let them close those fuckers. And also, the rest is fine. What the fuck do you need to? Almost. Tomorrow we buy the EXP to get the next level up. I feel like if I would need that much shovel in the night, I would probably be dead already. Um, but. And yes, I see the time. Right. Um, Gone either, right? Nah. Air flashlight. Not too high hopes. Wanna be over. Dust is still there, so I'll assume this is just normal. Rebuck event? Ah, nice, huh? If the game would toss me a bone. I feel like last night wasn't even that difficult. It was just a bad combination of things. Unless he can jump through a window, he can't come in. The doors are safe. One is it? That one of Oh, okay. Sure, jump over it, will you?
They came from three different sides. to destroy most of my things, did they not? Yeah. Like, he just... bashed through all of them. Probably can't even repair most of this. Oh. <laughs> I like that the wolf jumped up. <laughs> I feel like that was my favorite moment. <laughs> it was like, nah, man. You know how it is. <laughs> uh... Okay. I don't know. Surviving night seems like a bit of a struggle here. And the thing is, these things work, but the problem was... Whoa. Oh, there was the thing in there. Sorry. Just pinked off the ball. Well, okay, now it's getting glitchy. The bell does not work. Okay. The thing is, this does work. I've tested this. It was just too many things at the same time. Because if you do it like this... Ah, it's slightly bendy. And I think that's what got me. Because they push from two doors at the same time. Might need a chance. These lamps seem to be a little bit wonky on the head for that limb. I think they're on this side they're more wide, so I'd have to have them this time. A few more pixels to put them like this. But I mean, this only solves one door, all of this. I mean, the truth is, this is gonna be rough either way. So... I'm going to have to basically ensure that I get enough mandari by plundering everything in the map rather than doing the knights, for now at least. Because I don't think there was much I could have done there. Okay. Yeah, I have to bell here, but it doesn't work. Okay, let's sell. Buy more ammo. If any rooms, just do anything else. You know, you're right, because the thing is, 
This one here was a barricade that was pre-built where it says it's too strong to remove. So I thought, thought I had a safe space. Um, let me double check this. Damn. No. No. This is the safest room. Everything else has like full on broken spaces. Yeah, it is safe. Bad. Okay. Where if you fit in? I don't know what you mean with. Um, okay. Funny. You mean this one? You can not fit through. I at least can't. But this one here is full on open. And it has a wooden door connected to this. It's not. No. Like they would see me. Uh, selling stuff, yes. We're doing okay on money. Just have to keep up the plundering. Don't have enough room. That's fine. Um, we buy stuff from you as well. All your ammo. All of that. I might start making distractions actually. Why? Not yet. Um, wait, I wanted to sell more. Where did we stop selling? Um, take those, put it away. Uh, there's the bearchen. Don't need the bearchen right now, however. Um, bye. And this, oh yeah, we, we get the EXP for level up. And then we keep it at 5. Because that's a good number to have. This gives us the level up. And we will get... Level them. Close to... Can I also go back? Um, standing still. The question is how long and how well does this work? Because if it's like, oh yeah, you have to, to, to stand still for 10 seconds and then you're invisible. That's not going to help me when I'm being chased. <laughs> Double damage on near death can be good. But in most cases, I would like not to be at low health. <laughs> but double is a lot. I feel like it's chameleon either way.
can still swing and throw and shoot. <laughs> yeah, we like that. Okay, that's what I thought. From now on, go oh, level cap. What the sawmill? Oh, this can work at night. This is an interesting proposition, actually. Okay, uh, we are level cap. Mm, I bet you. You want up? Let's go. Uh, we have a bearchen here. Bearchens are very, very dangerous creatures if not handled correctly. She's only this tame because I have her tail right. If I wouldn't have her tail, she'd be clawing everywhere and wrecking havoc. Okay. You're okay, cat. Okay. Get them? Yeah, you don't want them. That's the thing. Okay. Okay, we're level capped. This means we can sell meat now, which gives us even more money. This is good. <laughs> yeah, he said he's not going to do any more injections. I know, but life is cool. Um, did I buy the clip yet? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's here. It's here. Um, Okay, considering how much wood we have, I might start building up fake things so they get busy. Yeah, but nothing to shoot. Okay, this is... This is what it is, honestly. Um... Let's take one trap at least. Okay, back into the village we go. Wait, what? Fence built? Hold on. What? The woods for healing, yeah. What the fuck is fence built? I never saw that option. I mean, they jumped that, right? I mean, if it just keeps them busy for a few more seconds, maybe it'll add up. Maybe it'll keep them busy. We do have the wood to spare, so I'm not even... Worried about using it. Yeah, that's what I think too. <sighs> this one's directly outside. Hmm. Oh, certainly I can pull it over, otherwise it'd be very inefficient for me.
Part of me wants to barricade everything just so they keep busy. And we do have the materials for it. Surviving a night would give us a lot more value than we what we would waste on doing this. Okay, anyway, let's go out. Maybe certain enemies can't go over it. Also, I think we did see the crow man, by the way. There was so much happening that I'm not sure what got me, but something got me, and I think there was a crow man in there as well. It probably is because I pissed him off here by disturbing the tree. That's probably what it is, honestly. Fucker, I knew it. Taking no damage at all. Taking no damage at all. Of course that wouldn't help. Yeah, of course, this is not a way. Oh my god. What is this con- It's conduct- It's pulling me in! Are you fucking with me? Can you- What, what is going on in this shit? What is this? What? Oh my god, he's a new enemy. What the fuck is going on? Ugh. What are these enemies? Oh my fucking god. I camouflage of water, poison and pulley hands? Is isn't that a bit much? Are you going for a swim, doggo? Come on, I can take at least you. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. I need a shotgun, but in order to get a shotgun, I need to upgrade my workshop. Okay. I have to do it like this. Means I have to bait. I thought he was there. Okay, I need to bait. It's much further than I saw. Really? <sighs> I need light. Nope. 
fight. Yeah, they won't last. Why did I pick them? Word thief has been scratched onto the floor. I don't think I have the skill to do that. No, I cannot. So what just happened? Where did it go? I really don't like this. Yeah, didn't want to be with me, I guess. But unfortunate. I kinda want to use that trap for it. What are these boys? They dragged me in. I think we've checked who... We're gonna leave that here so I can step in it later. Um, oh, it's time to eat wood. I, I cannot deal with these things on the floor. there is I'm fine Photo of three boys. So uh, it would seem like they stole something. Maybe they stole something from the forest and this is the curse brought onto them. See the crown of it. You know? <gasps> Are we winning? God damn it, Zuka. Thank you. Thank you for the help. Okay. We we got our cash for tomorrow sorted. We got an X handle and a fabric. So even if we die in the night, money is sorted. Um, wait, bitch, shut the fuck up.
just important that we keep the money. Fuck the mushroom, that's not gonna last anything. Um, okay, so this is where the tree is very likely. The question is, is it guarded? Does it want to talk to me? Is it hostile? tree is gigantic. Its bark stays in constant motion. It swells up and collapses into itself, as if breathing. I see human silhouettes growing out of this tree trunk. They're also moving, as if gesturing in slow motion. Dozens of mouths repeat their lines simultaneously, creating a uniform, noisy murmur. Between the bars, I can catch a man's gaze that's fixed on me, his body similar to the other beings it seems to form an integral part of the tree. His limbs are gnarled and his face is grotesquely deformed. He's the only one to acknowledge my presence. His hand slowly raises, pointing to something on the horizon above the roofs of the destroyed village. The man's lips are moving on the ghastly murmur, and the other voices drown out his words. Keep the tree. Actually hoping that the voices will go silent. Oh, this is my options. Okay, so we're not gonna piss it off straight. We're gonna see if we can liberate something out of this. <laughs> yeah, kick the tree! <laughs> because we really want the fucking thing to erupt into 500 chompers. Even though the figure speaks sluggish, it is too high for me to read its lips properly. One of the words is radio. I feel like neither of these two options are good. No, I'm not doing it. So, examine. I noticed a little smiling face of a girl gazing at me from behind a cluster of sleeping heads. Oblivious to the chaos around her, she studies me with curiosity. Just next to her, a massive man calmly hums some melody. The lullaby drowns in the overwhelming noise surrounding the tree. <clears throat> yeah, I thought that the radio would now do something. Uh, I'm barely able to make out any conversations and squabbles from the horrible noise of the repos. He took everything from us. The shouts come from an old man, only the tip of his head, and only his arms stick out from between the tightly crowded bodies. You stole it. Thieves. Made the dogs piss on your faces. But they did steal something and this is a curse for it. Right next to my woman's head, wobbling from side to side, repeats, We're hungry, we're hungry. <laughs> Enjoy, Ellie. Another figure hiding its face under the enormous root lets out a chilling shriek. Quiet, fucking quiet. Leave us in peace, shut up. He's interrupted by a man next to him, his intestines hanging out from his stomach. It was our own common good. It was meant for all of us. You stole it. Okay, so they had a blessing and one person was greedy. High above, at the top of the crown, two silhouettes hanging side by side. From their hands and legs grow into the trunk. They are trying to bite each other's faces off. So here's what I think. The tree is not inherently evil. The tree is just the curse that was brought on for doing something, stealing something. I'm probably not ready for this, but I just want to do a sneak peek. A hole in the wall of the basement, it must have been made by the growing of this. Do 
Wait, is this a bad thing? It is. Okay. I was thinking maybe I can take the source. But... Who's there? What do you want? Leave. Pizza slowly sinking into the soft rocky floor. I barely move if someone was holding my ankle. And the water is dark and cloudy. The corridor seems very long. Probably run out of oxygen. Okay, got it. I know where it is. Okay, 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 I got it. There is a oxygen base in my camp. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. He's going the same path, actually? What? Am I getting insane? Hold on. So this is just a circle. Okay. Pointless. Okay, so this gives me incentive to repair the oxygen station at my base. Okay, okay. Can I still eat log today? Okay, okay. Um, okay. Just, you know. Second entrance? Ooh, big. Food inventory, six potatoes. Your snake is dead, we're down to 26. Six potatoes, half a loaf of bread. Two liters of gasoline plus one potato. Your sec. None. Minus five potatoes plus one door. Okay. Three potatoes, four potatoes, three potatoes. They ran out of food, didn't they? Huh? Two sec. Twenty. Fifteen. No, they had left some. Then again, who knows if they really kept the log. Um, fuck stones. Wait. The hatch leading to the basement is blocked from the inside. This is an exit. Okay. Okay. This means I'm done here for now. I'm in. Um, Basement is flooded, eh? Am I right? Docks, bollocks, everything's fucking flooded. Turns around as if looking for something. Uh, what? Yeah, yeah. Elephants, fucking plonkers. Ever seen elephants, matey? What? Yeah, we have these elephants here, you see. They live here in this thousand part of the swamp. Their hut is in a thicket in the flooded forest. What? Since the woods trapped us here, they keep to themselves, they don't fancy us bloody elephants. They have these oxygen tanks, lots of tanks. And if the basement is flooded, you could use oxygen tank, eh? Food inventory? All sorts of things used to happen in our village. Sometimes a muck that punched for some silly thing. Then smile appears on the man's face. But we always stick together when the time came we had sometimes hear the voices of those times in the trees moans. Um, the fucking monstrosity won't let me forget them. Upon seeing the photo, Cripple cringes with disgust. These ruffians, eh? Sons of a thief. There were seven of them. The mother took the four youngest ones when the hunger struck. The other three stayed with the father. They were weak and sickly. One day the father got into his head that they are getting smaller rations because we have written them off and start them. So he went with a group of people to rob us off our food in the night. They broke into the basement, didn't end well. Triple goes silent. The lads threw them out the village. Um, don't know what happened to them after that. 
people used to say they wander into the woods when they said it's locked away. Huh. He gives me back. I can still hear cries of that thief all the bloody time. Yeah. But I tried to steal food. So before it went bad, he had a hunger problem. What would cause earth? It wasn't a blessing. Uh. Also, what is he meaning with there's elephants? <laughs> Fucking hell. I don't want there to be elephants in what there, there's no elephants. He means something that is big, but it's not an elephant. Right? Upgrade workshop, let's go. Shotgun. Hunting. Here we go. I need one more player. <sighs> I need one more player. Okay. <sighs> Sell that. No. Oh, a single shot. That's the same damage, right? It just shoots slower. We sell that. We sell that. We sell <clears throat> this. And we sell that. That's already quite some cash we're making. So even if we don't survive tonight, this is good for us. Um, Stacking this. We also sell this. Tanks go up. Sell it. Need to reload every shot. Depends on how strong it is. Here's hoping it's really, really strong. Um, these go into the other thing. Want more gas? Oh, this is the stuff that I sell. Yeah, this is for tomorrow to be sold. We're also selling these. Uh, natural tech. Back them. Okay, these go into the machine. And then it's almost. So, this here is a. So it's going to need me get the tank, repair the tank here, which needs another item. So this is a chain quest. I'm so glad that was running. <sighs> Where did he say? Oh. Oh, that's the old man advised supposedly in the southern part of the swamp. So I suggest tomorrow we go to the holes and see if this is like a big area. Holes could be portals, so quick travel, that's big, we need that. Yeah, I know what you mean, yeah, yeah. Quick travel would be big. Take it with us for what it's worth. We'll at least try to survive. This radio. There's this dude in the tree that's going to communicate with us through the radio. That's why he said radio. 
And it's either going to give us a hint or tell us what to do or maybe a code. It's going to do something for us. And it's going to be for once a good thing. Okay. And because... Fuck it. I don't want to die tonight. One step closer. <laughs> okay. This is as good as it gets. All right, my flashlight just in case. Have a <laughs> We're gonna sell this. I'm not sure what I'm doing with the assault rifle. So far, no vendor seems to have full-on magazines for it. But if I can find one, it's kind of good. But it's also worth a lot of money. I don't know. <laughs> Suka is guiding. Okay, here comes the night. Reverend. <sighs> so for now, we don't need to, because we have money. Even if we die now, we have enough money looted. But if we ever hit the point where we don't have enough, then I'm gonna sell it. Because it's not something we can rely on. Let's see. Oh, fuck's sake. Like, game, can you give me a break? out there. I think I saw him for a split second. Uninstall the mod. You know what's gonna happen? It's gonna be a poltergeist drawing everything through the middle and then them coming from all sides. This is so okay event. Oh, this is brilliant actually. I mean, then he cannot come in because we only have barricaded everything around us. Okay, this is, this is a really good event. And it's really good that it picked this lamp. This means it has zero impact on us. Oh, okay, yeah, I guess. I wonder if my scream goes through the wall and I'm willing to test this. 
Like, if I see some of them try to break it, I'll stand behind the wall and scream. This is fine so far. Yeah, it's fine, but it buys me time. And if you look at the time right now... I think this might be a win. Okay, that's really good. That's gonna give us money. Really unbalanced. I mean, it's RNG, it's RNG. But some of the nights we had are a lot different. Why did you turn all of them on? Okay. This is good. This is a lot of money. This is big value. <laughs> We're gonna build a single shot shotgun. We have the money to bash, bash it into it. Yeah, fuck off. Oh, wait. This is actually perfect. It did leave. It's just a dog anyway. 